in this video we will learn about variables so i have made a variable name number and assigned 90 to it so variables are also known as identifier so this variable is a name location used to store the data in the memory so now i am going to change the value assigned as 0.7 okay so when i print the number it will print the new value that is 0.7 so now i am going to make some new variable name so let's check first name as kuma let's check last name as last name Pillai. and then city equals so like this we can add more like age let's say 77 let me put is marriage equals 2 so let me add one more I will add here a list inside the variable skin so let's put here python let's put kotlin like this so now uh, let's make a person info so inside this person info we will store a dictionary so let me put the same as first name first name and then let me assign here the value as kuma so again I am going to put the key as let's say second name and let's put the value as so like this we can add more so I am going to print one by one so let me print the first name so we can print all okay. we'll put here last name and now let me print the skill and let's bring the person into so let's run and see the output so you can see the person info the skill list second name last name first name everything is here so now we can also put like this a b c so we can declare multiple variables in a single line so let me assign in A like 6 and I am going to put in B a floating point number and let's put a string inside C hello so let's print A so you can see it is printing the value of A similarly the value of C has been printed so we can also do like this like A equals 1 and then a semicolon b equals 77.7 and c equals 500 so let's print the c so here there is an error so we have to put here colon semicolon so let's run it once again so you can see the value of c has been printed so you can also do like this a equals b equals c equals 77 so when i print the value of b it will print 77 so these are the examples so you can also change the value like a, let me change here c equals 5 and let me print here a so you can see here the value of a is still 77 but the value of c is being changed so let me put here c so you can see here the value of c is been changed to 5 